presidential spokesman, one of the eight, Garuba Shewu, what he just said about, you know, Prince Charles and President Joe Biden. Prince Charles is the son of uh, the Queen, Queen Elizabeth, who is in her 90s. Yeah. And um, this woman has been ruling now for how many, I mean, for how many decades? You know, Prince Charles is the heir to the throne in Great Britain. Now, Joe Biden was elected after, um, you know, uh, former President Donald Trump was defeated in the last election. And Joe Biden is now the present president of America. And what Garuba Shewu said about this eminent personality talking about the heir to the throne in Great Britain, where we still have the monarch, you know, the order of the monarch still very much in place. We still have the queen who is the head, although we have a prime minister, but I mean, the system is still there. When the prime minister puts up the program for the year, the queen has to give her signature on it. You know, most things still pass through the queen, although she's she's the she's the queen and is the one you know the prime minister run the day to day affair, but she's still the head of Great Britain. And so, Garuba Shewu said something recently that is causing a lot of reactions. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like, or share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Garuba Shewu, a senior special assistant to President Muhammadu Buhari in a Facebook page mistook Prince Charles of United Kingdom for President Joe Biden of the United States of America. This has sparked up a lot of reactions and Nigerians are saying, how can? They don't even have understanding of what is going on and how things are being spelled out. Mr. Garuba Shewu, why trying to publish the image of Mr. Buhari as the toast of the international community shared a photo of President Muhammad Buhari with Prince Charles and Emmanuel Merkel. But Mr. Garuba She will mistake Prince Charles for the U.S. president. Garuba She will wrote, Hashtag COP26, President Muhammad Buhari with President of America Joe Biden and Emmanuel Merkel in the United States and France president in the presentation of the ongoing 26th climate change conference in Glasgow, Scotland. Nigerians have still since reacted, asking Garuba Shewu if he's all right and he needs a thorough examination because it does not feel very much like he's all right. Mr. Shewu, who will later delete the post after suffering heavy backlash from Nigeria, did not even dare to apologize and this is what is going on. You know, I mean, if it was Buhari now, if it was Buhari post that was deleted, he would have gone on straight and say, you know what? You delete my post. Yeah. Okay. Facebook will suspend you. So this is what is going on in Nigeria because when you oppose them and you, 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 you let them know that they are wrong, they become violent, they become whatever. And before you know it, they start taking, they start behaving in a funny way. You begin to wonder seriously, truly, if they are okay. Because you expected more from them. You see, Garuba Shewu has mistaken the president, <laughs> the president, you know, of America for Prince Charles. Can you imagine? That's the, that's the, that's the presidential aide. Okay. And you look at them, you are wondering. Do these people even understand the perils of leadership and the space that they occupy? Do they even have an understanding? I don't think very much that they do. They don't even understand it. They don't even know, you know, all that it entails and what, you know, is really surrounding and all that is happening. It's sad, but these things are happening. These are part of the occurrence of the people who are supposed to be in understanding of, you know, what is going on and be able to give direction. He's trying very much to, you know, make it feel like, you know, he's doing something worthwhile that could possibly help the people, but he's not doing it accordingly. He's not doing it well. No, he's doing it very deceitfully and people are watching. You know, these are people who think that they've got life in their hands. Recently, he was one of the people who was telling uh, uh, Southeast that um, they would do this and do that, kill them all. And everybody's just wondering, oh, guy, are you okay? Is everything all right with you? 
these are people who do not have because you know the other people are not from their region they don't have human sympathy or have understanding that you need to be careful you don't treat others like they are no human being then you are the human being then you are the one that should be treated decently and in order but this sadly this is what happened sadly this is what is going on and so nigerians it is really sincerely a wake up call you know these people most of them don't even have an understanding of the basic rudiment 101 of life and to be able to give direction and to be able to assist people they don't even know they don't even have a clue and these are the people you know who are encouraging and advising buhari then you wonder why buhari is the way it is and you wonder why you know the dispense of leadership it is the way it is because these are the caliber of people who are surrounding him these are the people who are who they rule together show me your friend to a large extent it's not the true it's not just the only determining factor i will tell you who you are just show me your friend okay just have a conversation with them just spend a, a bit a bit more time with them and you will understand who truly and really they are you know we need to wake up from this whole sentiment thing and come to reality check and come to the true reality of what is on ground enough of all this you know ah petty petty kind of thing okay let's come to the real let's come to the nitty-gritty the real deal let's call it spade a spade and let's stop you know playing playing around the world does not matter let's give value and substance you know so my people now say the bio your brother see uh, Prince Charles, he call him President Joe Biden. Then when he go see Biden, he go call him Prince Charles. Ah, now wow, now wow. Now so it just be you, Nigerians. Now what thing they happen be this so? Now the people where they call presidential aid in Buhari, they surrender himself. Now be this when they tell and say, hey. and if you see their mindset, their perspective, you know, towards people of the Southeast Nigerians, in their mind, they are the only one who is correct. They are they are at war with everybody that is supposed to be in the country. They are the only one who is correct. Every other person is, is lying. I mean, it is what it is. We must all now, you know, really pay attention to what, what our belief, what do we want? Because if we look at the leadership, we'll be making a great mistake. Okay? Leave us a comment. We'd love to hear from you. Please don't forget to like, or share, subscribe. God bless you. Have a lovely and a fantastic day. Bye for now. Bye.